boys and dolls welcome back to my channel so i am wearing a face mask because i'm being conscious and also not stupid um and i do instacart and if i hadn't said that before there you go i do instacart now um but i made my goal for today already <clears throat> and it's only five o'clock so I want to do a glow up because I haven't done it in a while and I feel like garbage. I feel really ugly. I haven't put on makeup in like <clears throat> over a month. Um, so let's do it. The next time you see me, I will be about to start. Okay, let's get going. Okay, fresh out of the shower, I've already washed my face and I'm going to be using my favorite oil-free acne moisturizer. Make sure to get that all over. And then I'm going to towel dry my hair for the most part so that it's about 85% dry. And I'm using my second favorite product, my Biotin Boost by Hask. I'm just spraying that right at the roots, making sure to massage all of the areas that I just sprayed it on, making sure to work it into the scalp a lot. This product keeps my hair nice and healthy and helps my hair grow. Okay, I'm back. Clean, I feel good. All right, let's get into the tan because this is probably the hardest part for me so I'm gonna just how do I how am I gonna do this okay go that's that's okay right um and then I'm gonna get a clip and clip my hair back and then start on my chest my arms and my face and yeah we'll get right into it Okay, and now that my hair is up, I'm going to be tanning with the St. Tropez Fast Tan, and this is in the lightest shade that they have. I found that this is one of the best tans for lighter skin tones because it doesn't make you really orange, and it doesn't get too dark too quick. In fact, I actually sleep in this, and I did let it go in between before putting my makeup on so it did have time to set in there. When you're putting this on, you want to use the mitt on a clean mitt and go in circular motions, making sure to cover every spot so that you don't have any missing spots where you can see your natural skin tone under it. It's hard in this lighting to be able to see the difference, but outside of the lighting and in the daylight, you can really see that golden tan. is also good to do because considering we're in quarantine right now 90% of the time you want your face to be the same color as your body when you decide that you don't want to wear makeup one day. So I 
I am going to be doing the meals as well, so I have meals here. I did get a new elf foundation. I love this one because it is about medium coverage and you can build it up if you want, but I usually keep it pretty light um, depending on the day and the situation, but I'm very excited about that. I've actually used it before and I love it. Next, I got a new camo concealer by Elf. I promise, I promise I'm not, um, not funded by Elf. my eyebrows and the rest of my face and then we'll be good.
now I'm gonna do my nails. I'm gonna change my clothes. And then lipstick, I think. And then we'll be done. I feel good about this. I feel really pretty, actually. Um, so let me just do all that. And then I will be right back. Okay, so I decided I'm not gonna change my shirt because let's be honest, I'm just gonna get back in my pajamas anyway. But for the full glow up look, I did my tan and my makeup with brand new products and oh, and my nails, which are these really, really gorgeous. Um, kiss nails and they're jelly so you can like see right through them and I just have been really into being able to see through my nail extensions lately so I did those all in the color pink which is my favorite color right now um, and my hair is naturally drying in its curly state which <clears throat> I really really love like I hate when my hair is straight so uh, that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, whatever it was, and um, I'll see you in the next one. Do not forget to stay safe out there and keep yourself together. You can't force someone to do something. Make it easier for them to stay safe as well, um, which includes wearing your mask and gloves. If you're handling like chicken or meat or anything like that, and then wash your hands. Um, just make sure to wash your hands and wear a mask and be safe because I would be awfully sad if you got sick. Um, anyways, thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you in the next one. Bye.